I don't like shorts. I'm not a huge fan of shorts. I don't wear them very often, but I'm gonna tell you what I do when I do wear shorts, how I carry and conceal and carry my other gear. My name is Jason Hansen. I'm a former CIA officer and the New York Times bestselling author of Spy Secrets that can save your life. And before I show you the shorts, and why I don't like them, but why I wear them sometimes. Don't forget to like, subscribe, turn on that ring notification. Please welcome back former CIA officer Jason Hansen. Former CIA Jason Hansen. This handsome fella is Jason Hansen. Okay. This is Jason Hansen, former CIA guy. All right, so why don't I like shorts? I just never wear them. I don't like them. They don't have as many pockets. They're not professional. If you're going through the woods and in harsh environments, your legs aren't protected. And overall, I'm just not a shorts guy. Pretty much the only time I wear shorts is when I go to the beach, which was very recently, which is why I've got shorts on right now. And also we've been among the hottest summers ever on record. It's been incredibly hot. And when it's brutally hot, yes, I will sometimes wear shorts, but you will still hardly ever see me in them because it is few times. When I do wear shorts, I'm gonna back up here, see if you can actually, I'm gonna have to go way back. Hey, uh, pull up my legs so you can see I got shorts. When I'm wearing shorts, it's cargo shorts. The reason it's cargo shorts is so I can carry my gear. If you're wearing gym shorts, basketball shorts, you can't have a belt or have your gun on or have your gun in your pocket, it's gonna pull everything down, as everybody knows, because those shorts are flimsy. The cargo short that I'm wearing right now that I like is by a company called True Spec, but there's a ton of cargo short makers out there. Figure out which one you like best, figure out which works for you. Most important thing is they need to have deep pockets if you're gonna carry concealed in your pocket. When I am wearing shorts, I like to carry in my pocket. It's quick for me to access, it's comfortable. I just, I'm a big fan of pocket carry. So you've gotta have a deep pocket, which not all shorts have. So when you get some shorts, your gun is almost sticking out, but when you have by jeans, certain jeans, pockets are not deep at all, and it's basically sticking out. So with this particular shorts that I'm wearing now, it's got good deep pockets. I can draw out, I'm gonna take it out slowly, that way it stays in the holster and doesn't get caught. But what I've got here is my six hour P365, one of the guns I carry most frequently, in addition to a revolver Smith & Wesson J-frame. But this hides deep in the pocket, it barely shows through. I don't care about printing that much, meaning when your gun prints through your clothing, because I live in Utah, it's very gun friendly. So not a huge deal to me, even though these cover it up well. And if I'm coming out here at a little higher speed, I can come back, do what I need to do. I've got everything. I mean, it works normal as my other cargo pants since these are very similar. So if you're gonna use shorts, you're gonna have to buy several pairs. You're gonna have to find out what makes sense for you. Now, if you choose to carry on your hip, which I don't do very often, especially when I'm wearing shorts. Shorts is almost always pod carry. When I got my cargo pants, I might have a 1911 on my hip, a Springfield 1911, Walther Creed, or any number of guns. But if you say, you know what, I'm never pod carrying, I hate pod carry, then you don't have to worry about the cargo shorts having nice deep pockets. You can just buy shorts, put on a good belt, that'll hold everything up. When I'm wearing my shorts, I got a lot of people ask me, hey, what do you do for a spare magazine? And the truth is, I don't use any fancy, fancy uh, mag carrier, ammo carrier, anything like that. I literally just take my spare magazine, which this is the one for my 365, and I throw it in a pocket. Depending if I'm driving or what I'm doing, it might be in the side pocket of my cargo shorts, it might be in the back pocket where it is now. It really just depends. Here's what I know, I promise you. I am very blessed to have many friends who are among the top shooters, top instructors or whatever. And every once in a while, these guys will be like, oh yeah, I use a mag carrier, I do this and that, and I have 27 mags. Guess what? They're lying. They're trying to sound cool in front of their class. Most of the guys I know simply take their spare magazine, throw it in a spare pocket, and don't worry about having some fancy magazine thing that clips to their pocket. Or another reason I don't use those is because I've usually got something to click to my pants pocket, meaning I've got a tactical pen on this side, I've got a knife on this side, so I usually have a lot of stuff that is clipped somewhere, and it's just easier to throw a spare magazine in there. I think that pretty much covers it about shorts, carrying concealed with shorts. Hey, if you love shorts, God bless you, me. You're not gonna find me in them very often unless it is 130 degrees, unless I'm going to the beach. If you wanna know more secrets, make sure you subscribe again to this video. If you wanna know more concealed carry stuff, definitely click on below, I've got some stuff for you. Have a wonderful rest of the day, and I was gonna say go put on some shorts, but don't do that. Go shoot some guns, go play with some knives, and I'll talk to you later.